over the holidays, we sold a lot of this because I had a lot of people come in here and say, hey, I'm looking for a gift uh, under $20 for somebody. This was our go-to wine. After nearly 20 years in the corporate world, Jill Molinari opened this Wine Styles franchise. To him, good wine and good customers are all that really matter. I think I'm doing all the right things, but at the end of the day, if the people don't come through the door, it is what it is. But these days, not enough people are coming through the door, and he is not alone. Strip malls dot this area of Grand Prairie, Texas, but most of them are either completely empty or about half full. This complex had just three tenants after being open for a year and a half. One store closed just last month after failing to make their lease payment. This strip mall was built nearly three years ago and has yet to see a single tenant. If nothing is done, this recession could linger for years. Thursday, President-elect Barack Obama urged Congress to act quickly on a stimulus plan, a plan he says that could help small businesses and big business, and that would create jobs. It is time to set a new course for this economy, and that change must begin now. For every day we wait or point fingers or drag our feet, more Americans will lose their jobs. More families will lose their savings. More dreams will be deferred and denied. And our nation will sink deeper into a crisis that at some point we may not be able to reverse. Meanwhile, Joe Molinari crunches the numbers to see how long he can stay open while waiting for customers he isn't sure are coming. My whole goal is to keep this business going. But if this neighborhood decides to shop at the Highlands versus shopping here or shop at Kroger versus shopping here for their needs, you know, we got some hard decisions to make. Rich Matthews, The Associated Press, Grand Prairie, Texas.